At number 10 on our top players of the decade, the only current player on the list, Kyle Wilson. Texas Christian quarterback Andy Dalton says he has to know where Wilson is on the field at all times. Number nine on the list, Chris Carr. He was Kyle Wilson before Kyle Wilson was Kyle Wilson. A dual threat returning kicks and a menace in the defensive secondary as well. At number eight on the list, Quentin Michael. He plays for the Philadelphia Eagles now. He's the only Bronco in history to be the Defensive Conference Player of the Year in both the Big West and in the WAC. Number seven on our list, Players of the Decade, Darren College. Might remember this game in 2003, shutting down the Beavers' defensive end. College plays for the Packers now, and he is teammates with our number six top player of the decade, Corey Hall. He also had a great game against the Beavers. Three interceptions that started his great career in blue and orange. Number five top player, Bart Hendricks, the original Bronco gunslinging quarterback, set nearly every record for passing in the Boise State record book until this guy came along and broke most of them. Brian Dinwiddie, Dinwiddie was the model of consistency. He owns 11 Boise State quarterback records. At number three, the high-flying Brock Forsey. He was a hard-nosed running back in 2002, 26 rushing touchdowns. That's still a school record. Number two, another running back. And what more needs to be said about this next guy than statue left, the proposal, and more rushing touchdowns in whack history than anybody else, Ian Johnson. And at the number one spot, the guy that opened a lot of those holes for Ian Johnson in the 2006 season, Ryan Clady. Of course, he now plays for the Denver Broncos. He's Boise State's first ever first round NFL draft choice.